Hello friends, I am Dr. Prashant Sharma and you are watching Medicos Hub 2. In this video, we are going to discuss the directly acting muscle relaxants. Directly acting muscle relaxants do not act on neuromuscular junction. These act on muscle fiber usually. Main function is that these uncouple the contraction of muscle with depolarization of motor and plate that is motor and plate is depolarized but it will not result in muscle contraction now what are the various examples first example is dendroline sodium mechanism of action dendroline sodium inhibits rhinodyne receptors on sarcoplasmic reticulum in muscle fiber rhinodyne receptor is basically a calcium channel so it is present on sarcoplasmic reticulum and if these rhinodyne receptors are inhibited then calcium will not be released in the sarcoplasm from the sarcoplasmic reticulum so no muscle contraction will be there so thus muscle contraction is prevented now uses drug of choice the androline sodium is the drug of choice for malignant hyperthermia another use is that It can be used in neurolept malignant syndrome. Even 25 to 100 milligram of dendroline sodium QID can be used to relieve muscle spasticity in conditions like hemiplegia, paraplegia, multiple sclerosis, cerebral palsy, spinal injuries and upper motor neuron disorders. Side effects are also there like muscle weakness. Hepatic abnormalities or toxicity why it is there because dendroline sodium is metabolized by liver and excreted by kidney it is having T half 
of about 8 to 12 hours. Next is malaise and lightheadedness. Next is diarrhea. And it's important that some level of sedation is also there. One other point is that fast acting twitch muscles are more affected than slow anti gravity muscles. So these are the various points of discussion in dendrolin sodium. Now the next drug is quinine. What is the mechanism of action? Quinine basically increases the refractory period and it decreases the excitability of motor end plate. Because of these two reasons, response to RNS that is repeated nerve stimulation is decreased. Now the uses. Quinine is used to treat the nocturnal leg cramps in some patients but because of the frequent side effects it is not used commonly. Another is that it can also be used in myotonia congenita. But important thing is that FDA has warned about the life threatening side effects of this drug. These are very serious side effects. Low platelet count, neutropenia, hemolytic uremic syndrome, black water fever and torsets de pointers. So these are the various drugs which are directly acting muscle relaxants. In the next video, we will discuss the centrally acting muscle relaxants. Hit the like button, share and subscribe our channel to get the latest updates and notifications.